With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Question is, if alpha, beta are the roots of equation ax square plus bx plus c equals to 0, then the value of 1 upon alpha square plus 1 upon beta square whole square. And these are our options. So we have ax square plus bx plus c equals to 0 and alpha, beta are roots of this equation. If alpha, beta are roots of this equation, we can say the sum of the roots equals to minus b upon a where b is a coefficient of x and a is a coefficient of x square and the product and the product of the two roots will be equal to constant upon the coefficient of x square. So now we have to find the value of this. So first we will find the value of 1 upon alpha square plus 1 upon beta square. Then we will do the squaring of this. So now taking the LCM, it will be equal to alpha square beta square alpha square plus beta square. So now equals to alpha square plus beta square plus 2 alpha beta. We are adding this and we are subtracting this upon alpha square beta square. So from here we can write this part as alpha plus beta whole square minus 2 alpha beta upon alpha square beta square. So 1 upon alpha square plus 1 upon beta square over here. Now, now we can write it as alpha plus beta whole square minus 2 alpha beta upon alpha beta whole square. Now we can replace our value of alpha plus beta and the product of alpha beta. So alpha plus beta is minus b upon a. So minus b upon a whole square minus 2 alpha beta. The product of the two roots is c upon a upon c square upon a square. So now when we take the LCM of this, this will be become B square upon A square minus 2C upon A upon C square upon A square. Now taking the LCM over here, then this will become B square minus 2AC upon C square. Because this a square and the LCM of this a square will be cancelled out. So this is equals to 1 upon alpha square plus 1 upon beta square. We need to find the value of 1 upon alpha square plus 1 upon beta square and whole square of this part. So the value of this part is this. It means b square minus 2ac upon c square to the power square whole square now we can write it as b square minus 2 a c whole square upon c 4 so this is our answer it means our option d is our correct answer thank you for class 6 to 12 itj and neat level trusted by more than 5 crore students download doubt and app today